Hey, I am Parthush. So in this video, I am going to use the document understanding feature to extract a table from a PDF and write the extracted data into an Excel file. So let's get started. Now to use the document understanding feature, we need to install two packages. One is document understanding and the other is intelligent OCR. So you can simply install them by managing packages through managing packages. Now the first step is loading taxonomy. So I've created a taxonomy file. So this taxonomy file to extract the data is a bit different than we use it for simple data extraction, which you can see in my previous video of document understanding. So in table extraction, I have selected the category as PDF named it as table extraction group is table extraction. Now here are the fields. Now in fields, these are my three column names. So let me show you the PDF which we are going to extract. So this is the table which will extract the data from and write into the file. So here as we can see, there are three fields or three columns you can see. The one is product one, product two and product three. So what I've done is I have selected the column name. Here you can select the table. So here we are selecting table. Now product one, product two and product three. If you have more columns, you can add different column names. And then, then I need to click on save. So here we have created our taxonomy. Now we'll digitize the document so here we are specifying the file path. So you can use your a variable where you will keep the value as document path. Then the document text and document object model. Here we need to select an OCR engine. So I have selected Tesseract OCR. Now data extraction scope. Now this particular activity will help us extract the data. And then we can validate that particular data. And after human validation is performed, the data will be written in an Excel file. So here are the fields we need to provide our document path, document text, document model, the above variables, taxonomy file, and document type ID. So when you create uh, or load a taxonomy, a taxonomy JSON file is created. So here, if you go in the file, you will get the document id over here document type id so you need to just copy this and paste it over here now here is the output the extracted text now you need to use different extractor to extract the data so there are form extractor intelligent form extractor machine learning and regex so form is where we have a structured data so since table is a structured data we are using form extractor now here the endpoint is selected by default form extractor and now here the api key you need to get it from cloud.uipath.com you will get in the licenses section you can copy that api key. now here we need to create a template of the table which we are extracting the data so when you click on create template you will get this particular field so select the document type table name it and also if possible, always give a simple document so it might get easier. Now here I have created a template. So let's check that. So these are some instructions you need to keep in mind. So here, if you use control and you need to select five fields to let the document understanding feature identify that there, this is first particular page. Then this is the table which we need to extract. So in extracted table, uh, this statement is a bit wrong, but in extracted table, you need to click over here. And here, when you click, click on extract new table. So when you click on that, you will see this particular thing. So just drag and select the table. Now extract header as well, product one, Product two, these are my column headers and product three. So when I click on save, save and close. 
so here if we see highlight table we can see the table is properly highlighted so just save this so now we have we are going to use this template so click on close after that we need to configure the extractors so extractor we have created in the taxonomy already so here we are going to use table extractor save it. now we need to validate this particular results to check if whatever the data is extracted is it matching or not or you need to make some other changes so here we are specifying the document path the text the object model the taxonomy file and the extracted text which we got over here in the data extraction scope so we'll use that data and validate that data so the after the data is validated we'll get this validated data now we are going to use the validated data to export our extraction results so here we are using validated data and here we'll get a data set extracted so now we will use that tables in the data set and write it in our excel file so here i have just used a simple for each loop where i'm using the table so in case if you have multiple tables in your single pdf and you have configured the extractors for that then you need to use it for each loop so for better understanding i've used this for each loop so here i'm writing the data into the excel file so these are complete all the steps which you need to perform to extract a data table or a table from a pdf and write it into the excel file so let's just again go through the steps first is creating the taxonomy and loading it the second is digitizing the document and selecting the ocr engine then is the data extraction scope where you need to specify the document id and use the extractor depending upon the application you require so here we have used form extractor because we have a structured data then you need to create a template configure the extractor as we selected the table after that present validation it is used to validate the data then export the data from the data set get the tables using data set dot tables and write it in the file so this is the complete workflow to extract the table now let's just save it and run the file So now the file is running. Let's wait till we get the human validation from. Yeah. So this is the PDF and the extracted table. So if we see, we have product one, two, three square rectangle circle red blue green 4000 5000 6000 so we have all the data perfectly extracted and as you can see we are having confidence level 100 save and close save all the steps are performed now let's see do we have the excel file over here yes data is the file so yeah here it is all the data perfectly extracted from the pdf by following simple steps in document understanding and this so whenever you change the table in your pdf or you have a different pdf you just need to create a taxonomy file other all the steps will be remain the same then you can define the extractor as you want you can use intelligent or regex or machine learning extraction so follow these steps and create your own workflow where you can extract the data thank you